An Axton man was indicted by a Henry County grand jury on Monday in connection with the first-degree murder of his girlfriend's father. On February the 18th at about 1.05 in the morning, the 911 center received a call from a person that said that someone had been shot in the abdomen at 964 Southland Drive in Martinsville. Deputies arrived and found Ray E. Durflinger, Jr., 42, at the residence with a gunshot wound. Durflinger was taken to Sova Health in Martinsville, then airlifted to the Atrium Health Wake Forest Baptist Hospital in Winston-Salem with life-threatening injuries. A criminal complaint by the Henry County investigator E.D. Monroe on file in the Henry County Circuit Court Clerk's Office states that Jacob Raleigh Robertson, 23, was at Durflinger's house visiting Durflinger's daughter, who was Robertson's girlfriend. Durflinger and Robertson began to argue, and Durflinger told Robertson to leave numerous times. But Robertson remained and continued arguing with Durflinger. Durflinger approached Robertson's vehicle, and Robertson opened the door of his vehicle and fired once at Durflinger, striking him in the abdomen. That, according to Monroe. Durflinger was then flown to the Baptist Hospital in North Carolina, where he remained intubated and in critical condition until he died on March the 14th from his gunshot wound. Robertson was initially charged with aggravated malicious wounding and use of a firearm in the commission of a felony. He was released on a $50,000 bond. But when Durflinger died 24 days after he was shot, the aggravated malicious wounding charge was upgraded to first-degree murder, and Robertson was jailed in the Henry County Jail without bond. For the Martinsville Bulletin, I'm Bill Wyatt reporting.